guys, welcome back to the Home Gardening Channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how to work peat moss into your soil. We're in Florida and the soil here is very sandy and really compacted. Uh, this is actually what we're standing in is my uh, compost pile and this is very dense. It has a lot of organic material from yard, uh, yard waste, house waste like the, the food and all that goes into this and it breaks down in this soil and it becomes compost. Uh, it's very dense and I noticed that a lot of my plants uh, have gotten compacted around the roots. So I'm going to show you guys how I work the moss into the soil to loosen it and peat moss is kind of I'll show you here real quick what it's like for those of you that have never seen it it's almost like it feels kind of like like broken up cork um, so it's really really uh, soft and it's fluffy and what I do is I just take this uh, this is two cubic feet and it's all for $11 at Lowe's so this is gonna make our, our soil be more aerated so it breathes better. And you can just do it with a shovel if you got you know some compost outside, or you can actually work it directly into your soil. So this I work it into the compost and now we're adding we're adding peat moss with compost into our native Florida soil, which is mostly sand. Your, your roots and your plants really really moist and it can cause you a lot of problems so adding this in allows for it to be fluffier and for the water to stick in there to stay at the roots but also not stick around for too long and drown your plants or cause rotting so it really helps if you got dense soil or clay or anything like that to add some peat moss I hope this helped and it taught you guys something new about a new uh, product to use or add to your to your soil and improve it so you can get bigger harvest so i hope you guys enjoyed this short video remember to subscribe like and share to keep us growing and i'll see you really soon on the next one